Oh, what the hell? Let me give them another shot. Zeros. I didn't expect anybody to get through this. It's so, it takes so long. All right. Ring! <laughs> Hi, thank you for calling Destination Food Services. Um, thank you. Please hold. Um, hello? to purchase suicide? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm so sorry, sir. <laughs> I thought you were on hold for customer service. Then why did you answer the suicide hotline? Uh, sir, I apologize. Um, with whom do I have the uh, pleasure of speaking? Charles, but I prefer Charlie. Charlie, uh, you reach our cross-functional, cross-discipline call center. We actually specialize in 22 different categories. <laughs> I must have gotten my lines crossed. <clears throat> Why were you calling again? Suicide. Right, 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 right. Um, and uh, when exactly did you decide to purchase and commit suicide? Are you even qualified to talk to someone like me? Not exactly. Then why did you answer the suicide hotline? Because. Fernando, the guy who normally runs this line, had to step out, so he asked if I could answer the phone while he was away, but he assured me that no one would call because, you know, it's, it's a Monday night. <laughs> so? Well, our analytics show that people off themselves beginning Wednesday, escalating Thursday through Saturday with the biggest numbers on Sunday. And only five people in the past five years have done it on a Monday. Well, excuse me for messing with the standard deviation of your data analysis. Are you a data scientist? Because we have several openings. <laughs> no, I'm not a data scientist. I'm a dog walk. Huh. What a coincidence. A lot of people here have dogs. Did, did you have a flyer you wanted me to post? Or... What is wrong with you? Charlie, please bear with me. I, I, I'm not equipped to handle a suicide customer. You know, a lot of things you buy them, you can return them, but this, this is, this is unreturnable. I am fully aware of the irreversible nature of my intended actions. <sighs> Put your supervisor on the line. This is outrageous. Wait. Uh, sh sure. Uh, uh, please hold. Man, this would make a really great story. <sighs> Too bad I won't be around to tell it. <laughs> <laughs> this is a need to supervisor. How can I help? I want to end my life. We don't recommend that. But isn't the customer always right? We ask that you consider alternatives. For example, how about instead of ending a life, you start a new one? Why not have hot sex with your girlfriend? Or your wife? Or just someone who wants to get pregnant? Wait a minute. Is this Anita? Are you trying to disguise your voice? Charlie, I'm I'm really sorry, but my supervisor can't help you. She she specializes in fast moving consumer goods. Fast moving what? You know, gum, candy, cigarettes, things that are consumed quickly or thrown away after a single use, you know. Fast moving consumer goods. Got it. I'm a throwaway. No, 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 that came out wrong. I'm But before I'm thrown out? I'm, I'm to impregnate someone? 
How about I transfer you to one of our sperm banks? That way you can impregnate oh, oh. someone without bothering with the sex. Oh my god. <laughs> it was just a suggestion, Charlie. I'm really trying here. This is hilarious. Here is the 11th hour on calling suicide hotline on a Monday night, which is statistically inconvenient. No, no, no. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> I said statistically insignificant, not inconvenient. Well, excuse the hell out of me. Let's fast forward to the significant. I'm standing on a stool, noose around my neck, about to jump, and I'm asked for a purchase order. I already apologized for that. <laughs> <laughs> but, it, but it gets better. <laughs> and then I'm after my sperm. <laughs> so it's working, right? Working? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I distracted you. You're, you're even laughing. You know, I'd say that a suicide customer goes from despair to having a good laugh. Well, that's that's pretty good, right? Huh. Well, how about you ask me as a customer to stay on the line when we're done to give you a five-star review? <laughs> <laughs> you would do that? Even from the grave? <laughs> <laughs> this would make a great YouTube video. You too can prevent suicide. Just jerk off into a cup. <laughs> you're finished writing your five-star review, I can send you over to Walmart where you can enter in their sweepstakes to win $50 worth of fast-moving consumer goods every week for a year. <laughs> <laughs> or <laughs> I can start my own category, fast-moving consumer sperm. <laughs> <laughs> changed your mind? I've changed my mind. Good. But before I let you go, you have to promise me that you're going to call me every single night for at least a month. <laughs> what about Mondays? Huh. Especially Mondays, Charlie. I'm serious. <laughs> oh? How serious are you? Dead serious. 